Becky here. Welcome back to another episode of Five Minute Monarchs. I don't know about you, but I have been seeing so many more butterflies flying around lately and a lot more monarchs visiting my milkweed. How about you? Where you live, have you seen more butterflies around? It is an exciting time of year. Well, I'd be willing to bet that when you see those butterflies flying around, those delicate, beautiful, light and airy butterflies flying through the air that you aren't thinking about, defense, defense, right? But those butterflies do have to defend themselves. Let me tell you how. Now I want you to think for a second about a sign like a sign that you would see when the floor is slippery at school or a sign that you would see driving on the road that says caution or wants you to yield or pause or stop even. What colors are those signs? I sat in front of some flowers that might give you a clue. Most often, those caution signs, those warning signs, are bright colors. Yellow, orange, black. What colors are monarch butterflies? When creatures have bright colors or very distinct markings, that creature would be described as aposematic. And that just means that their, their bright coloration and the markings that they have serve as a warning mechanism to any predators that might want to take a little bite out of that creature. And monarchs are aposematic with their bright orange and black coloring. Even in the caterpillar state, monarchs have a defense mechanism and it is the color of their skin. That yellow and black and white coloring kind of signals caution. Hey, I don't taste very good to anything that might want to try to eat the caterpillar. It serves as a warning and the reason why they don't taste good is exactly what this guy is doing right here munching on that milkweed Milkweed has toxins in it, and those toxins make the caterpillar taste super bitter, and anything that might try to eat it might get sick if it eats the caterpillar. Pretty cool the way nature creates these defense mechanisms. Munch away, little guy. Protect yourself with that milkweed and your beautiful, bright, warning colors. Now when that monarch butterfly e-closes, a lot of the toxins from the milkweed that the caterpillar ingested as it was growing and eating stay with that butterfly uh, as it moves out into the world, providing another layer of protection if it should uh, get nipped at by a bird or something takes a little taste of it. All right, friends. Next time you see a monarch butterfly flying by, take notice of those beautiful bright orange and black colors and markings and think about aposematic creatures, defense mechanisms. I'll see you next week. Bye.